Hey guys, it's Jesse. It's not going to be like a typical vlog, per se. Um, it's past midnight on the 18th of um, June, 2016. And, uh, anyways, I just wanted to pass along some info to you first. First of all, um, if you saw a post I made on Facebook, oh, let me clear this up. If you look at my sign here, that's hanging on the wall, it says, Peace. Love, peace, and freedom. Okay. Um, it looks tilted, like it's off kilter. But what that actually is, is it's my camera. The, uh, you know, of course, it's the camera. It's got it's that long. And then it's got the flip finder that you can flip each way. And so the flip finder is a little heavier, so it weighs the camera down just a bit. And so it's slightly off. And I just actually, like when I upload my video, or when I put my videos on my computer and watch them, I don't really pay so much attention to what's behind me or anything. I'm just paying attention to what I'm saying and the way I look, make sure I don't look like a fool. Or the dogs are not doing something they shouldn't be, or whatever. But, um, <clears throat> so, I don't have a tripod, I don't have a selfie stick or anything like that. And I'm not even sure if my camera would, uh be able to be put on a tripod not sure but um so I have to set it on a stack of stuff right here books here um the other thing I went up to my grands to uh I've got a shower here of course okay you know it's a full fun fully functioning apartment here um but my water pressure is crap and my hot water heater this is going to sound really weird, but my hot water heater is actually two sections over. It's on the other opposite end of the damn building for my water heater. The water heater for the middle section is right in the middle. <laughs> so my hot water take, it takes like three minutes for the water to run to even get hot and then the hot water doesn't last but maybe five seven minutes tops and personally um, if I had no hair that would not be a problem for me but since I have lots of hair uh, shower times you know do go up so I went up there and I knew that they had great water pressure because I've lived there for 10 years and so um, I went up there to take a shower see when I, it was yesterday evening last night it's last night I think I don't remember anyways uh, I got in there and of course I'll just have to take you on a tour of their house I guess and let you meet them because y'all you guys do need to meet them and I am trying to figure out some other type of content to provide with you so it wouldn't just be so boring but um anyways I got in the shower and once I was completely wet in my hair, you know my hair soaking wet like I go for the shampoo my dad who lives on the property with them uh, and takes care of them um, or he mainly what he does is he does all the maintenance work uh, it's a very large house, very big property lots of grass to, to mow, big hedges to, to trim lots of stuff so he's always busy but um, he has real fine hair and so the shampoo bottle in there was for fine hair and there was like this much left and I was like I'm not gonna take the rest of my dad's specific shampoo so I like I've never done this before like I probably did as a kid when we didn't have money but um, I just took the bar of soap and like lathered my hands and lathered my hair and just used soap I know it's probably not good on my hair but that's probably why it's giving me fits today because it ain't cooperating with me today at all um it hasn't all day but um so yeah that but besides not having the right kind of shampoo that shower was amazing because i could stay in there as long as i want there they have two the house is so big there's two water heaters in the house and um there's plenty of water plenty of hot water and what was was my bathroom the shower in there it's not a very big shower, it's a stand-up shower, but it's like, 
you turn that water on and it's hot or warm, you know, it's whatever temperature you want, and it's just like, oh, it's just amazing. The water pressure is just out of this world wonderful, and the hot water was just great. It's been a long time since I've had like a really, really, really hot, hot shower uh, for over 10 minutes. I think I was probably in there for about 15 to 20, mainly just standing there in the hot water because I, I haven't been able to do that in a long time. But um, that was that was good. My grandma's doing better. I'll just let you know my grandpa's fair, but my grandma's doing much better. Um, there's so many things I wish I could tell you guys, but there's some things that I'm not going to say. Um, my family watch my videos and they run back and tell tell on me because um, I mentioned I was going to shave my beard which as you see I haven't yet and I'm not just saying yeah I'm going to shave it and the next day wake up and say oh no I'm not going to shave it that's not the way it is um, I'm going to get into that in just a moment but I had uploaded that video saying you know I'm going to shave it tonight or whatever and one of my family members I'm guessing probably a cousin or her mom saw it and told my grandma that I had shaved my beard and so when I came to see them she was like what's wrong where's why ain't you shaved your beard somebody told me you shaved your beard she really hates my beard and hates my hair but I told her to screw off on my hair leave my hair alone but the beard she can bitch about all she wants because I kind of bitch about it too anyways but um whenever somebody says uh you need to cut your beard that just makes me want to grow it out more you know it's my beard leave me the fuck alone you know just leave me alone I'm not offending nobody anyways if you can hear this sound that's my computer I don't know how much longer my computer is going to be with me um, and that's going to really suck because I'm going to have to get a new computer of course don't have the funds for that gonna have to figure out a way and I don't want to sell any of my personal items because I've sold all of my personal items that I could part with some things I don't did not want to part with but they brought the most money but um, and even my mom nobody knows I've been selling my own stuff to make enough money to get what I need in life uh, but anyways um, this computer was at that about a thousand dollars uh, it's, a very, it's, a, it's a very great computer. It's a Windows 7. I bought it years ago. Um, it's a wonderful computer, big screen. Um, but the, something's wrong with the fan. It's going to have to be fixed, and the screen is screwed, so I have to hook it up to the computer. Or hook it up to the TV anyways, but I still don't know how long the computer's going to last. It, uh, it's, it's just about on its last leg, so that means I'm going to have to get a new one. In, a, in time, and eventually, in time, I'll get a new one, because uh, it won't be right away when this when this one does go completely down on me and um, that's gonna kinda suck because I don't have a tablet and I, my phone's not a very big phone so it, like I hate using Facebook on Facebook app on my phone it's just ridiculous um, this is kinda turned into a vlog I guess but uh, there's something special with here in a little while alright the other thing I was gonna say was um, wait a minute, did I talk about the post I made on Facebook? No, I didn't. I made a post on Facebook, and it was kind of calling out my family, and it's not my dad's side, it's my mom's side. Um, my, her first cousin, my second cousin, and his wife and two children, one is 16 months and one is three. Uh, they lived in a very, very, very bad place in Ohio, and uh, like literally just feet from their where they lived, there were these certain people on the sidewalk selling crack. So the kids could never go outside. They didn't have grass. Uh, they never had ever seen a dog until they. My mom was kind enough to say, you know, come, come. He is, his family, uh, he's my family, but his family is, we're all here, mainly. Most of us are all here uh, in this county or in the state of Arkansas. And uh, he wanted to be where, um, he wanted to be, he wanted to come down to uh, 
to be where his father was from. And um, plus he needed to get out of the situation. And so um, my mom said, you know, come, come, come here and we'll help you. You don't have to stay here until you get your own place and stuff. And, you know, I was okay with that. Um, unfortunately, on their way, they had to take a bus. On their way, he was either pickpocketed or somehow his wallet missing. And it had everything. Birth certificate, social security, money, uh, bank cards, everything. <clears throat> and um, it's not good because they would have already been in assisted living here in town um, or in a rent house or something by now but they haven't been able to because he doesn't have his information and so it, you know it takes a while to get the information like restarted you know issued reissued and stuff like that so anyways um, they all went to the river the other day yesterday was and um, the little 60 month old they had put out the fire because they were all packing up and getting ready to go they had put out the fire and um, unfortunately there were still some coals left in the fire they thought it was all the way out but it wasn't um, and the little girl her mom turned around for like a split second everybody was watching her mom turned around for a split second and the little girl just walked into the to the, to the um, coals and she burned her feet and like a little bit of her legs but everything else her whole the rest of her body is just fine but um they are from Ohio of course and she was burnt you know she needed to get to help as quickly as possible uh, so there was a, uh, they took her to the hospital over in the next county and the helicopter came then the helicopter refused to take her because their insurance was from Ohio and not Arkansas and so they had to put her in an ambulance and drive her all the way to Little Rock to Arkansas Children's Hospital which is two hours away, plus, two hours plus away, um, but Arkansas Children's Hospital is the best hospital in Arkansas for children, plus the best burn unit in Arkansas, period, but um, she's fine, she's still got bandages and stuff, but she's great, um, she's doing so good, and um, really don't have to worry about anything with her it's it wasn't third degree burns so that was really good it, you know because it was been water had been put on it coals it wasn't red hot so it was just you know hot enough to make second degree burns but um see how long I've been talking because I've got to add something special okay I'm in five um so anyways that was a it's been a been it's been a trying day I didn't let y'all know any about this they've been here for I don't know how many days now but they've been here for sometime um, but the post that I made on Facebook which my YouTube friends or my other friends on Facebook that don't know about any of this or my family do know but the, the, the post was directed toward my family because we have asked them like it's okay for them to be here but we have asked all of our family uh, for help like uh, um, at least 30 of them for help and we're not asking for them to take them in because they're here and that's fine uh, they just don't have any money because they're all their money his wallet all that and um, but they do have we do have food that's fine we're, we're good with food but they need to uh, they need like some you know just necessities diapers and um, all that kind of stuff just necessities people would need and uh, Like, even we asked one person, do you have just an old phone, old smartphone that's not even connected to, to a network that, that one of them could use just here off my Wi-Fi so they can use their Facebook and 
their messenger and their you know so they can talk to their family that the what little bit of family they did have left in Ohio or what have you and they could talk to each other if they get separated if one one goes here mom mom and the wife goes somewhere and the dad stays here they can, can they can talk you know nobody of course my family members have multiple phones that they don't use I'm sure they it doesn't have to be a brand new phone or anything but um, they were like no and then some of them were just like no we can't help you we got enough on our plate and no 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 so I just kind of busted out on Facebook just calling them out and it's really ridiculous because I can't explain it I maybe I'll go into it at a later time um, So anyways, that's what that was about. And uh, my family has responded with through posts, not on that post, but other posts, and saying that I'm hypocritical and I'm making my, myself out to be a saint and that I'm perfect and I'm actually a horrible person in real life and all that kind of stuff is crazy. Uh, they just don't, they can't handle the truth. And I tell the fucking truth and they can't handle it. So anyways, um, besides that, uh, well, my grandma, I, as soon as she gets a little bit better, I'm going to film her watching Two Girls, One Cup and some other crazy videos and get her reaction because she's price, her reactions are really priceless. Um, so look forward to that eventually. And um, there's so much other stuff I could talk about, but I'm not going to. I'm going to get to what? The reason I actually turned the camera on. I'm going to sing you guys a song. I'm going to accompany someone singing. Um, <clears throat> hopefully I don't sound too horrible and the sound isn't too loud for the camera so you can't hear me. Um, but anyways, I've never really sang in front of anyone. My mom has listened to me sing before, but I don't do my best when people are around. Um, but I listen to all kinds of music all day long and sing along, especially if I can have, if I know the lyrics. I know the lyrics to thousands of songs, but um, some songs I need lyrics to, to get whatever. But um, I'm working on several different genres of songs because I'm thinking about doing the talent show at the uh, county fair this year. And uh, this is a potential song I may sing if I can get the track by itself. But anyways, um, any of you guys heard of Radiohead? Uh, love it. Love Radiohead. And the song called Creep. Uh, the, the Radiohead version is more rock or I don't even know what you call it, punk rock, something like that. I mean, uh, but this is slowed down. This is, you'll, I think you'll enjoy it. Um, but I'm going to sing it along with her and her style. Her name is Tiffany Gray. You guys check her out on YouTube at Tiffany Gray Music and I hope you guys enjoy it. so there probably won't be ads on this video if there are ads then uh, I'm not getting the revenue because I'll probably get a copyright strike anyways so here we go let's hope this goes well I couldn't look you in the eye You're just like an angel Your voice makes me cry You float like a feather In a beautiful world You're so very special 
I wish I was special But I'm a creep I'm a weirdo What the hell am I doing here? I don't belong here I don't care if it hurts I want to have control I want a perfect body I want a perfect soul I want you to notice When I'm not around You're so very special I wish I was special But I'm a creep I'm a weirdo What the hell am I doing here? I don't belong here Oh, he's running out again. Oh, he's running. Oh. He's running out again Oh, he's running Whatever makes you happy Whatever you want Cause you're so very special And I wish I was special But I'm a creep And I'm a weirdo what the hell am I doing here? I don't belong here I don't belong here Hope you guys enjoyed that. Hope I sounded good because I don't know. Sometimes I do, sometimes I don't. Um, I'm kind of working on uh, a few other songs, but um, I don't know if I'll ever put them out. I hope this video gets uploaded. If, if I sound like really bad, I probably won't upload it. <laughs> and I might redo the video without the singing. Anyways, I love you guys. Peace. And um, spread love, spread joy, spread happiness, spread peace. Be a peacekeeper. I am... Uh, Considering myself a peacemaker and a peacekeeper, I'm still looking for an, a really an, an acronym or something for it. But we we got to be more positive. We got to be more peaceful. You know, need more happiness in the world. Love you guys. Peace. See you later.